Hey RD fam, it's Rita. Welcome back to my channel. If you are new, definitely make sure you are clicking that subscribe button, liking this video, and commenting down below, and also turning on your post notifications so you will never miss an upload from your girl, which is me, period. And also share my videos with anyone who likes Sims or just anyone, period, because like, why not? But we're jumping right back into Get Famous, which is my favorite LP other than Rita's life, as you guys should know. Um, if you guys didn't watch me, you know, basically updating their looks, you guys can go watch that. It's almost the last video that I uploaded um but yeah we're trying to get freaking finished with get famous because get famous has been going on for like ever all right so it's love day I'm gonna try to decide what I want them to do um she has a gig tomorrow at 9 a.m and I believe that her gar guitar skills are already level five so I think I'm just gonna have them spend some time today be romantic because it's just like why not um I don't think she has a gift to give him yeah we don't have any gifts to give, but we are going to be romantic um, because, you know, it's love day. So let me just be romantic with them, blow a kiss, um, caress his cheek. And we're also going to embrace him. And um, Parker wants to come over, but we might actually do something else, you guys, only because... Um, I didn't really plan out this part because if you guys didn't know, I actually had Corona and I reached 1,000 subscribers this weekend, which I think is freaking insane. But, um, wait, what's the next thing? Get flowers. But it's just like, um, I thought I was going to get the community tab right away. So I couldn't tell you guys that I actually had Corona, which I wanted to tell you guys, but I couldn't, um, unless I made a video, but I was literally too weak to make a video. Like I wasn't really sick. But I was weak, if that makes sense. So now I'm going to have him be romantic back to her because, you know, that's how Love Day works. You have to be romantic back. Um, I'm going to have him offer her a rose. And then the last thing is to go on a date. But I think I might not have them go on a date um, just because we're going to do some other things. And I'm, I'm going to actually have him call out of work, um, which he literally never does, you guys, like, ever. Um, so let me see. How can we call out of work? Because take, okay, not take a vacation. Can we take a vacation day? Okay, I see it. Take a vacation day because, yeah. So in honor of Love Day, Samantha School always allows students to buy flowers to be delivered um, to each other during class with money to spend. Samantha decided to take advantage of the fundraiser and celebrate the holiday. Um, buy flowers for everyone in class. So let's see what that says. Um, so we are going to go upstairs, you guys. Okay, we're going to go to the hot sub and we are actually going to have them try for a baby because I've actually been thinking about this. You guys know I literally, me, me and Sanai just don't get along. Okay, we just don't. Like, I don't know what it is. Like, she's just an annoying toddler to me. But hopefully this other baby, if she gets pregnant, will not be an annoying person because I literally cannot deal. Like, I can't, okay? Like, I don't know why Sanai is so annoying, but she just is, and she stresses me out, honey child. She stresses me out. So, yeah, they're woohooing, whatever, whatever, underwater, breathing underwater, stuff like that, getting really nasty and dirty. Um, and then I'm going to actually have her go and take a pregnancy test. And we're also going to do something else that's really, really going to be fun, but, like, I don't want to say it yet. That's why I'm not even going to let Parker come over to the house because, honey, you can wait. Um, if they can get out of the water, like, it's been a long time. Samantha's out of school, and it's also Sanai's birthday. All right, so what do I want Sanai, I mean, Samantha to do? She is going to just come over here and have, and they're, like, stuck in the freaking hot tub, I guess. Um, okay, so I'm gonna have her come over here. I guess dry laundry, I'm not really sure if it's dry, and take a pregnancy test, and then we're gonna do something else that's gonna be really, really fun. <sighs> we'll see. She's pregnant, you guys. That's actually really exciting. Like, they deserve this. Um, so, yeah, the last thing that we're going to do, which is going to be really exciting. So, Salim actually got a good reputation, and he became good friends with Sanai. So, she's actually getting really, really tired, but it's fine for now. Um, yeah, I never, like, really do much in Sims, so, like, I'm, like, confused. Okay, plan wedding events. Okay, they're gonna get married in this part, because this is their first day that they're actually not busy. Um, cannot plan. Oh, wow, I really wanted them to do that, but 
it's fine, whatever. So we are actually going to plan a birthday party then. Um, I'm just going to have her go to sleep because she's really, really tired for some reason. And then um, I'm going to have him plan a birthday party for Sanai because um, I want everybody to come over. And, like, I don't even know where the maid is because the house is kind of dirty. And, like, I really don't want people at this house if the house is going to be freaking dirty. Like, I literally see these clothes outside replace we are going to unload and set laundry down and clean the lint tray and then we're going to flush the toilet because i don't know why it's not flushed um and of course we are going to plan our birthday party event just 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 wait okay we got to clean this house we are not doing anything in a dirty house. And a lot of you guys have been actually asking, okay. Okay, so a lot of you guys have actually been asking me about my computer specs. I put them down in the description box for anybody who wants to know. So if anybody comments that, I'm just going to say refer to description because, I mean, that's, that's where it is. So yeah, just refer to my description bar and it's down there. So let me see how I do this, you guys. Like I said, I never plan events and, um, okay, plan a social event. And Sanai is really his twin. That's the crazy part about it. Okay, so we are actually going, I didn't know that we could do a fan meet and greet, but we're actually going to try that one day. But yeah, so we are going to do a birthday party. Wait, can we still do the birthday party though? Okay, yes. So, Salim Benali, and then the guests are going to be Samantha, Salim, Sloan, Clement, Clarence, Parker, Angel, and Akito, who looks very weird. Um, we're going to hire a caterer, and we are going to hire an entertainer, and we're actually going to hire a mixologist, and we are going to have this at our house. Um, I think this is our house. And yeah, it's time for a birthday party. Um, excuse me, please put this in the freaking hamper. And I don't like their outfits, but I'm not going to change them um, because I don't really feel like it, to be honest. And I'm going to have him come over here and clean it up. And then I'm going to have Sloan wake up like a little bit later once everybody arrives and, you know, the mixologist people and stuff like that. Um, so clean up. And why is he struggling to take this to a hamper? This must be their formal wear outfit because their formal wear outfit sucks if I could talk, literally. Um, so yeah, Clarence is here, Parker is here. This is exactly why I didn't want to invite Parker or over only because I knew that I was going to do this eventually. So yeah, but everyone's here. Um, I think, yeah, music is playing. Everyone's good except for freaking, um, she's going to sleep on the couch. Okay, that's fine. I mean, on the floor. <laughs> I mean, that's just a mood, like, literally, like, okay. So, yeah, I'm going to have Sloan wake up, and, of course, we're going to talk to Parker and share our big news with her. She's feeling a little bit sick, but that's okay. She just changed her outfit, which, oh, my gosh. I need to edit all their outfits because, I mean, hers isn't that bad. So, she said, I got in a fight with someone at school about which void critter is more powerful. I said it was Articorn, but he kept saying Sunator. Which one is it? The Articorn, of course, I guess. We haven't seen them in forever. And you guys, look at Angel. We haven't seen her in literally forever. Um, okay, so I'm actually going to invite Angel to dance and give her a little friendly instruction because this is our cousin and we haven't even really like met her and they're both kids. So I'm just like, why haven't I had them socialized way more? Like, makes zero sense. But yeah, so I don't know if there's a cake um ask her about her day and then i'm going to have um salone add to her instagram story because you know she's at her, her daughter's birthday party i literally cannot talk i literally can't i don't see a cake though oh i see the cake okay so we are going to actually age her up now so we're gonna help blow out candles and lean sanai if i can talk y'all i literally cannot talk oh my gosh it's so annoying i hate when i'm like tongue-tied and literally I'm recording because like some of the time I talk to myself when I'm like not recording and I'm not tongue-tied it's like once I turn on this mic my tongue just goes all different directions and I'm like please just just stop okay so yeah we're gonna blow out the um candles if we can I don't know why it's taking so long oh you guys I feel like she's been a toddler forever just haunting me like literally Okay, so I hope she blowed out the candles. I think she did. Okay, she's about to age up. I don't know why she's walking like this. Hurry up. 
because you're she she this is what i mean like me and her just don't get along like literally what is her problem i think she's glitching out but i'm not exactly sure okay she's aging up finally so i'm just gonna randomize okay so she got erratic and then we're just gonna give her this mental one she's gonna be a whiz kid but she's erratic which i'm not surprised because she has definitely done a lot um, so we are going to remove the candles because we don't really need them. And then I'm going to have her, um, grab a piece of cake, take a piece. And then I'm actually going to have Sloane, dang, I was going to have Sloane get a drink, but she's pregnant, so she can't. Um, I'm actually going to have him order a drink. Um, let's order, a uh, pros and pop. Can't believe she aged all the way up. Like, um, I'm going to obviously edit her once everybody's gone. It's literally 12.03 a.m., Oh my gosh, wait, I need to like ask everyone to leave once we're done because that's crazy. Yikes, I really didn't know that it was that late at night. I should have, I should have checked, but I didn't. What is this? Relationships? Oh, happy birthday. Shame about the party. At least someone left a book as a present. It's in your household inventory. Um, so she's about to go throw up, I think. And then I'm just gonna freaking get the house ready and... Just have everybody go to sleep because um, I'm pretty sure everyone's tired. It's really late. So, yeah. So, she's going to go to sleep. And then um, he's going to go to sleep as well. And uh, she's going to go to sleep. And then I'm going to have her come up here and take an angry poop. And then we're going to change her outfit once she comes up to take an angry poop. Okay. That's what we're going to do. And I'm going to turn auto lights, all lights. And I'm actually going to turn this off as well. I'm just so happy that she freaking aged up. Because I, I could not deal with her as a toddler. Okay, so I'm going to go to cast.full edit mode. And we're going to take her into create a sim. Okay, so you guys can obviously see how beautiful Sanai is. To me, she still looks exactly like Salim. So yeah, I'm just going to have her um, go to sleep. And I'm going to make sure that everyone's sleeping before I, you know, um, have them, you know, what is it called? Why does she keep glitching? Like, oh my God, it pisses me off. Um, okay, so yeah, she is going to go to sleep. Why? Go to sleep, girl. I need to put a hamper in their room or I just need to get a better maid because I don't understand this. I don't understand why all this stuff is still on the floor. But yeah, so I'm going to pick up when one of my Sims wakes up. Okay, so Sloane was the first Sim to wake up. I'm actually going to have her come over here and unload and put laundry away because that laundry has been in there for years. If it's not dry, then I don't understand because... Yeah, I was about to say, and that just means that um, our freaking dryer is not working. But yeah, so she's going to go downstairs and eat and also shower or, um, yeah, she's going to 
Well, she'll shower up here because she's already in the bathroom. So she's going to take a quick shower and then she's going to come down here and grab a serving to eat. And then she's going to get ready for her gig, you guys. I hope that this gig goes well because we don't have the time to be playing around. We really, really don't. Um, I just want her to get it over with at this point um, because I really want her to, you know, get finished like I want to finish this let's play because you guys know how I end my let's plays I end it by doing a whole hour episode so it's like we're trying to finish this okay we don't we don't have the time so yeah she's gonna eat this macaroni and cheese and I literally love their house like it really came together and um you guys know it took a while to come together but it really really did once it did um he must be grilling Oh my gosh, why are you making baked potatoes at 8.45 a.m.? I just don't understand. And I'm going to have him clean up as well. Why is he cooking? Is he about to cook again? Okay, so she's going to her gig, you guys. Um, I don't know why she dry clothing. Wait, what? Dirty clothing. She's wearing dirty laundry. And she got an envious fan texting her phone, I guess. So we need to get a better maid because it's just like, where is our maid? Like, I don't... I don't understand, like, y'all, I literally can't remember this thing, like, I used to, but we need to cancel our main service, <sighs> and then hire a new one, because this is ridiculous, like, this lady, or this man should be coming when they're supposed to, and they're literally not, um, so yeah, we're going to get some French toast and then I'm going to take care of his needs as well. I'm just going to have him come down here and use the bathroom and the guest bathroom. And then he is going to go downstairs and write a book for his job, of course. So we're going to resume writing Mirror Schmirror. Um, Samantha woke up, so she is just going to eat some French toast as well. And then I'm going to have her come up here and take a shower. Um, Sanai's still sleeping, of course, because she's just freaking tired. Like, she just needs to catch up because she's just dead. So, yeah. There's just too much food all over this lot. Like, it's just too much. Like, we just need to just clean. Like, a deep clean. Because this is just ridiculous. Seriously. Like, even the toilet stinks. Like, this maid just needs to hurry up. Like, we just... It's too much going on. So, she passed the audition, which is perfect. So, um... The gig starts at 12 o'clock p.m. on Sunday. We need to develop our fitness skill and our guitar skills. So I'm just going to have her come down into the basement, you guys, and literally use the bathroom. And she also has to throw up, so I'm just going to have her throw up. And um, I'm going to have her work out as well. She barely works out. Like, bar either one of my sims, they barely work out. Oh, wow. Salim has work in an hour. Well, he better hurry up because he has to finish this book. And hopefully he does. I don't know if he will. Now she's washing her hands. And some of these rooms, most of these rooms I kept with the original um, decoration only because I just didn't feel like it was necessary for me to change it when it was already done. Like, unless I just really, really didn't like it. But for the most part, I kept all the rooms pretty much um, at its same decoration. So, yeah, she just needs to eat. So I'm going to actually um, have her take these two the hamper if she will and then grab a serving of food and then we're just going to get back to sloan she needs to finish developing her fitness skill she's at 25 percent and then once she's done with that i'm going to have her add to her instagram story and check social media timeline okay she didn't even finish so we're gonna have to have her finish working out what the heck we're at 3901 followers which is perfect i might actually have her record um a video as well she's almost done she's at 50 percent and she's watching tv too while she's working out so period and she's pregnant too like she is just gonna be snatched who's calling her congratulations on your recent birthday thanks akito even though i don't know how i met that man um so yeah once she's done she's gonna do her homework she's doing her homework as well and she's almost done working out okay so she completed it and then we have to develop our guitar skill and stuff like that. So let me replace that. And, um, yeah, this is just her recording space. So I'm going to have her reply to some comments. Um, we don't have any videos in our inventory. And then I'm just going to have her um, 
jam out to some songs because she has to practice her guitar skill so why not have fun doing it she gained 175 followers from replying to, to some comments now she's just strumming for fun samantha earned the responsibility trait samantha is just ugh, amazing like she's just doing so well and she's not feeling well well she's been sick for a couple of days so that's understandable um when is she aging up you guys in four days, Samantha's going to be a teen. I wonder if she can do extra credit work. Yes, so she's going to do that. And then I'm also going to have her freaking um, clean out her spoiled food. And then as for Sloan, I don't know what she's doing. Um, she needs to come back downstairs and finish developing her guitar skill. Why does she even stop um, practice? She wants to socialize with the girls, but, like, she's busy, like... We don't have the time and we're supposed to develop a friendship with the director, but I don't think we're going to do that because I think, wait, let me see. Oh, see, we have to invite over everyone. Like, no, I literally hate doing that. Even though that could help us like go up. I just, yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Should I invite them all over? My house is messy. My house is dirty. Girl, I don't know. And I was going to have her record a video. Let's record a cheerful vlog. See, we don't have time to invite over the director and the co-stars and all of them. We just don't. Like, we don't have time to become friends. We just, we're busy. We're busy people. And why is Parker here? Like, how did she even get in my house? Like, come on, girl. You're doing too much. Okay, so she needs to pee. She needs to get in the shower and she needs to bring her fun up. And then as for her, she also needs to bring her phone. I'm just going to finish recording this vlog. I think there's actually like a whole outside thing. Yeah, that's how she's like seeing us. And everything in our house is glass. So I know that she sees us, which makes it even more worse. But she'll be fine. I need to actually... Oh, thank you for Sanai. You see, Sanai was annoying when she was a freaking baby. But like she literally is cleaning up the house for us. Like that's top tier behavior. Like I appreciate that so much. Like we needed that. Even though she has to pee, she is cleaning up the house. Like, thank you. So maybe we can invite over um, the freaking um, co-stars and directors because Sanai is helping us. So, all right. Her manners went up from that. Salim is home now. Um, so what do I want to have him do? He wants to bring up his fun. So do we have any, like, mail or anything? I want to submit a book to the Sci-Fi Digest thing, um, self-publish Life in Court, and also self-publish Bare Naked. Okay, so for his fun, we're just going to watch channel, watch action, and um, she also needs to get her hygiene up, so she's going to use the guest bath, and um, I'm just going to have her play with her toys. And she's still down here. Oh, no, she left. Okay. So I'm going to have her eat. Um, I'm just going to have her clean this up. And um, serve dinner. We're going to have Italian meatballs. Or should I say Italian? Like, if you watch freaking Power, he was always like, Italian? Italian? Like, okay. And maybe we'll try to go on vacation. I'm just trying to spend time with them since, you know, this Let's Play is coming to an end, you guys. And, um... I feel like this episode is going to be so much longer than I want it to be only because I'm trying to get the um, gig in it as well. So, yeah, this part is probably going to be longer than my other parts, but whatever. We're just trying to get this Let's Play done so we can make room for other Let's Play. Excuse me. And you guys know I work full time, so it's kind of hard for me to get record videos and stuff like that. But I'm trying to make time because, y'all, we are growing. Like, literally, we are growing. Is anybody else hungry? Samantha's hungry. And Salim is hungry as well, so he's just going to grab a serving. And then um, I'm also going to focus on getting his fun up as well. Why is going to the bathroom more important? Grab a serving. And then watch a movie. And then she's also going to grab a serving. Like, what are y'all doing? Why is she not grabbing it? Oh my gosh, grab a serving right now. And then he needs to grab a serving. Like, what the heck? Oh, my gosh. Can you eat? Why is this? Why are they doing this? Okay, let me actually order her some medicine because I don't know if that's why she's not eating. Because um, Samantha definitely needs to take it because she is freaking sick. So, let me just put it on the floor and then freaking 
um, take the medicine because, girl, you are sick, sick, okay? And eat Italian meatballs. And my cousin's freaking trying to wax herself, y'all. Literally trying to wax herself. And it's not working. Why is... Okay, I'm going to have to reset Samantha because she's just not doing anything that I'm asking her to do. Okay, so let's start this over. Take medicine. As for Salim, so he's just not eating. He's just being stupid. So we're going to clean this toilet and then we're going to use it because somebody has to clean it. And then um, he is going to eat his meatballs. Um, I don't know why she's not taking the medicine. So I'm just going to put it in, take medicine because I don't know what's happening right now. And it's pissing me off. Okay, so she finally took the medicine, and then he needs to come over here and clean the toilet and then use it. Because, yeah, they were pissing me off. And then she needs to eat. It's like once it's time to eat the meatballs, like, they want to glitch. Okay, so sit down. Like, what the heck? Why did I have to even do all that just for her to eat the meatball? And why is this not clean? Clean the toilet. And then I'm going to do the same thing for him. He's going to sit down, and he's going to eat. And then um, she's kind of hungry, so I'm going to have her grab a serving. The only person that's freaking sleeping is Sloane as she should and then um everyone's gonna go to sleep as well as you guys know we encountered some glitching so that's why we're kind of behind schedule with them but it's fine <sighs> he's just finishing up and um is he gonna eat or why won't he eat like i literally don't understand okay grab me serving because you just That looks freaking, that, that, uh, we're just going to have to do it, okay? Because he's glitching and I don't know why. Ugh. Okay, so I changed his outfit. Everybody should be going to sleep. Um, as for him, he really needs to eat. So I'm going to, again, try to get him to eat these meatballs because I honestly don't know why he wasn't eating them before, but now he's eating them. So, yeah, and then I'm going to have him come upstairs. We're not going to wait any longer. Ooh, actually, no. I'm going to have him... Um, Put away leftovers once he's done and then he's gonna come upstairs and he is going to take a shower and then he's gonna go to sleep um both girls are sleeping she's napping for some reason i don't know why she needs to wake up and actually like go to sleep um but yeah i think one of his something of his outfit was like glitching him i don't know what it was but it was it was pissing me off okay it was really pissing me off so i'm happy that i freaking got that fixed and he ate an excellent meal, so he's feeling really good about that. Like, yeah, we were trying to get you to eat that meal for, like, five hours. And he probably has work. Yes, he does. He does have work. But he doesn't, we don't have time for him to write a book or anything because, as you guys can see, it's 5 a.m. when he's going to sleep. Um, and then the girls are having freaking nightmares and stuff. <sighs> It's just like if it's not one thing, it's another with this household. So um, I did keep telling myself that I actually needed to get, to get the girls um, the freaking um, light that will like help with the nightmares. But I kept forgetting. So that's definitely my fault. Um, it's this right here. So we're going to get this purple one. And we're just going to put two in the room. So yeah, that's my fault because... Ooh, and I actually need to get a hamper. I almost forgot. So hamper... And I have a lot of custom content, so it takes a little bit, a little bit to load. There's their hamper, and then I'm going to have them clean up their room since they're not even freaking doing anything. Um, and they're all mad that they're wearing dirty clothes, so yeah, I'm going to have her take it to the hamper. And um, yeah, they're feeling uncomfortable because they just seen a monster, but they will be fine. Don't even wake up your mother. Don't do it. <sighs> um, let me have her hug Uni. Just go talk to Uni, girl. Like, we're we're going to sleep we would be going to sleep like quicker but um they're scared so i'm just gonna have them talk to each other um because they don't really have anything else to do so funny make silly face um monkey around you know do some little kid stuff whatever okay so now sloan's awake you guys 
So I'm going to have them go to sleep because they need to. And now Sloane's awake. We barely got a break from these sims. So, yeah, she's going to use the bathroom. Um, I don't know if she's throwing up or peeing. Oh, she's peeing. And I'm actually going to have her um, also throw up because she's just not feeling well. And then um, she's going to clean. And then I'm actually going to have her do laundry once she feels better, I guess, because it said that she cannot she cannot clean right now because she's too uncomfortable. Um, and her gig is at 12. So I definitely want to get her in a better mood. Um, I don't even think we have a tub anywhere. So I don't know how we're going to get her in a better mood. But we're going to try. Um, and she's mad because she's like wearing dirty clothes and stuff like that. But it's like we're trying to get you in a better mood, girl. So we are going to have her eat. Um, let me have... Um, get leftover she's gonna eat some meatballs for breakfast whatever as long as she's eating and she's just very uncomfortable y'all not even slightly very uncomfortable but we're gonna actually have her watch the comedy channel because she needs to do laundry like somebody needs to do laundry so girl that's unfortunate that you're feeling this way but you need to get yourself in a better mood you have work okay like i don't know if you forgot but you definitely do yep at 12 um, like you threw up everything. Like, trust me, I sympathize. I've been pregnant before, but you know, you got things to do. Okay. So she's, excuse me, in a way better mood, probably because she ate, which I mean, we can all understand. Um, and I don't even know if she's even going to have time to do laundry, um, wash laundry. Cause yeah, they were all very pissed off that they were wearing dirty clothes and I was tired of freaking dealing with that. But yeah, she's about to have her gig, y'all. Um, y'all, I thought that that was gonna glitch. Oh my gosh. Okay, so we just arrived on scene. So I'm actually gonna have the children care for themselves. I'm actually gonna have all of them care for themselves. Um, but yeah, so what we have to do is up here, you guys know we always do hair and makeup first. So get hair and makeup for a gig. Um, they weren't expecting us to be pregnant, but here we are. I don't know why, but I feel like she's having a boy. Um, I didn't check or anything, but I'm pretty dang sure she's having a baby boy. Um, so yeah, we're just going to get into hair and makeup. If it's another girl, I'm just going to be like, wow, a girl. All right, so then we are going to get into costume. And then we are going to um, practice acting. Um, and we also have to use the bathroom, which this is why I hate having a freaking pregnant sim. Because, like, ugh, it's just like never ending with the using the bathroom and throwing up and stuff like that it's so annoying like it's just like an always and she actually has a shower too yeah that's the first oh actually we're not gonna shower because she's washing her hands that brought up her hygiene she's also throwing up so we're just gonna come over here and we're going to um gossip with this lady friendly freaking where's gossip um okay so we have to ask her about her day as well so yeah how's your day going miss girl how's it going um and then we are going to get notes from the director um and then we're going to tell him that we are ready because we are and she has a great reputation and actually it's so much um better that wait what was i about to say that she's doing well while she's pregnant on the freaking set. Because, like, usually when my sims... Well, I was doing... When I was pregnant, I had a freaking sim that was, like, a famous person or whatever. And, like, she was just not... She was not doing well. She was not. Okay, we're going to safe sing. Because I don't know if she knows how to sing that well. So, we're just going to play it safe. Because I don't... Honestly, I don't know if she knows how to sing. Okay, so now we are going to dance. Um, we're going to risky dance. Because I feel like she could dance. Okay, so there's another dance scene. Okay... Um, so now we have to perform, um, the guitar scheme, which we're going to do risky because I know that she could play the guitar. So that's just like a no question. All right. So lastly, we have to perform the lockup scene, which I don't know where it is. Oh, it's right here. Um, risky lockup. Perfect. I feel like she did amazing. She's really tired now though, but her mood pretty much stayed high, which is really, really good. 
<sighs> set is going black and she's trying to go to sleep on the couch um okay so that's a wrap sloan finished all her scenes the crew is shutting down and the footage is being sent to editing okay so she actually just got promoted to superstar you guys that's freaking insane let me just turn the camera around so we can see her she is like so freaking happy um so yeah um she didn't master the acting skill yet um, but we're almost there. So yeah, I'm just gonna have her book a gig and then we are going to end this part. Um, I don't know if she's gonna get like the biggest paying gig, which is this one, um, Dignity and Decorum. We're gonna book that one because that's, we haven't done it. So yeah, I'm going to end this part here and I hope you guys enjoyed it and I'll talk to you guys in my next